welcome back and uh, let's get this one finished off today the A3 S line is almost done we just need to put the inner wheel arches in S line badge on the wing bolt the under tray back up and I need to finish adjusting that headlight oh I need to clean off these number plates because some of these stuck stickers all over them where I reckon they've put um, either a show plate or something over the top. So, let's get it done. And then once we're done, we can go for a little test drive down the road. It's already got MOT on it, but we are going to put another one on there. And then we'll bring it back, park it up, get the missus to come have a look because she doesn't really pay much attention. And I'm going to give her the car. I think she doesn't like being on camera, so I don't know how she's going to react. I don't know whether it'll be like a, oh, thank you, or a, huh. I wouldn't be surprised. Right, so, <clears throat> let's just get these little bits smashed on there and get this built done. We need to be ready for the next one. Next line again. All right. In the wheel arches. <laughs> Finished Audi A3 S line. Everything's painted that needs to be painted, just needs a good clean now. Everything is repaired. Now we just gotta take it out for a quick little drive just to make sure that it drives straight because as normal I've not driven the car at all other than up the driveway. So I'll go for a little drive, a little test drive, take you along with me just in case, because the other time with the Scirocco, if you've watched it, I took it for a test drive and when you guys weren't with me, so I'd smash it back up just after fixing it. So I'm gonna bring you with me this time. This was glued to the front and I thought it looked stupid. So that's the front of the car, without. That's the front of the car with. Now I'm sorry that camera angle's not really great, but I've asked my children and my partner and myself, I actually think it looks better with the badge. You know, I'm not sure. So I'm asking you guys, I am not gonna stick that on until I've had at least two comments saying whether to leave it on the car or keep it off the car. So let's get it driven. I'm gonna get my son to wash the car so it's spick and spam, looking clean as anything, inside and out. And then we just wait for the, the missus to finish work and we'll hand over the keys. <laughs> Look at that. 
needs a good clean. Full reverse camera. Full touch screen. The works. So the brakes are rather squeaky at the minute. Because it hasn't been moved for a while. Is I am going straight right now. Here's a little need to get the alignment done. Got a little bit of poke as well. One point six turbo diesel power. Not quite a sports car, but. drive just to make sure there's no kinks, no lights, no beeps, no flashes. That's all done. Like I said, I'm going to have to have a look underneath. There'll be odd bits and bobs for that one. In other videos from now on as well, like sorting out the opening of the boot. I worked out what it is. It's the little piece of cable that goes onto the hoop. The little U-bit that the cable goes into is broken. So I'm going to do some uh, B-roll with the boy washing the car. And then the next time you see me in about two seconds, I'll be giving the car over. Go get in it. Show you something, it's cool. That'd be the wrong side. You like this one though, don't you? Yeah. It's yours. It's like I didn't clean the inside though, I, I kind of forgot. What do you think, Harry? Hmm. It's mummy's new car. <laughs> then you can rub at that door. <laughs> Is that your thing? Yeah. Right, we're going to leave it there because obviously she gets uncomfortable. So other than the odd bit that i got to do, like the boot. Hey, I ain't told her yet. Uh, with the boot and I need to start the track in. That is that car completely done. Still waiting for that one to go. New build should be here next week. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Hit that like and subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.